You know, it's not difficult to drum up support for hockey's winter classic at Heinz Field. Especially when the Mount Lebanon High School drum line is part of the show. Dave Crawley explains. Dig in for it and make sure the last three taps are, are still marcado, okay? The Mount Lebanon drum line brushes up for a big audience. Real big. They'll be seen by millions of viewers in the U.S. and Canada New Year's Day. They've been selected by the National Hockey League to show their stuff at the Heinz Field Winter Classic, Penguins versus Washington Capitals. Percussion director Rick Minotti says they'll drum the players onto the rink. So at the end of the tunnel, there'll be a gauntlet of percussion playing both uh, snare drums, bass drums, cymbals, and also very big uh, concert tom-toms and two very big bass drums, one with the Penguin logo and one with the Capitals logo. No word yet on who gets stuck with the caps, but it'll be worth it to perform on a national stage. It's really exciting. I mean, I'm not much of a sports person, but it's still like a really big event. We're used to having some pretty large performances, but nothing quite like this, to be honest. Over the years, the drum line has been as much a part of home football games as the team itself. Their predecessors were the first band east of the Rockies to march in the Rose Bowl Parade of 1955 with what was then America's largest drum. That historic drum, all five feet across, was recently refurbished. They even found hardware just like the original and, of course, the original cart that pulled it. The drum captain already had tickets to the Winter Classic. My dad and my mom are going to go, so now they don't have to fight over who takes me. Preparing for a classic appearance, I'm Dave Crawley.